Hey there, viewers. I know this sounds silly, but is your colon clean? Seriously, this is something you need to consider, especially as you get older. Did you know colorectal cancer or colon cancer is the third most commonly diagnosed cancer in the United States? Pretty freaky, huh? While it may seem like the end of the world, there are plenty of signs you can look out for. Do you have constant diarrhea? How about extreme bloating? Have you had constipation for the last two weeks? Wait, can a bad colon actually give you yellow eyes? Let's talk about 11 signs your colon needs help. Number one, yellow eyes. Simply put, cancer can give you yellow eyes and skin. It's known as jaundice. It sounds like something out of a horror movie, and in many ways, it is. This condition is brought on by something called bilirubin. That's a really sciencey word for the yellow pigment that causes discoloration. When the bloodstream has too much bilirubin, areas of your body will turn yellow. If you have colon cancer, you may notice the white in your eyes changing color. This change can also happen due to gastrointestinal bleeding, which causes a drop in red blood cells and serves as a warning sign of colon cancer. Have your eyes ever changed color due to health problems? Share your story in the comments section and help create a dialogue in our community. Number two, mysterious weight loss. If you have colon cancer, you'll notice you've lost an unexpected amount of weight. You'll wake up one morning, step on the scale, and notice you're a little lighter. This is one of the more overlooked symptoms of colon cancer. Unintentional weight loss is normally classified as dropping 10 pounds or more in a span of six months. When you're sick with cancer, the cells in your body use up a ton of your energy, which takes a toll on your immune system. Because the body is working so much harder to fight the disease, it will process food quicker in order to convert it into more energy. As a result, you'll lose weight. But that's not the only factor. If a tumor forms in your colon, it can cause blockage. This will affect your bowel habits and lead to further weight loss. Do you find this list interesting so far? Be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring that notification bell to stay up to date on all our great bestie content. Number three, fatigue. Colon cancer or cancer of any kind will make you feel weak and fatigued. This is again due to the cancer cells using up much of the body's energy. Excessive internal blood loss will also result in this fatigue. There are other factors at play as well. Your rapid weight loss will also contribute to this feeling of exhaustion. This is all the more reason to consult a doctor. Number four, loss of appetite. When you have colon cancer, you won't be as hungry. Come to think of it, this can also add to your weight loss. Loss of appetite is common with any type of cancer. But with colon cancer, your colon's inability to break down important nutrients will result in less of a need to eat. Cancer can also affect the way your food tastes. This will only discourage you from eating further. Because of your fatigue, you won't be as active. If you aren't taking part in any physical activity, your body won't burn through as much energy. In turn, you won't feel as hungry as those who are out and about. Number five, diarrhea. This one's touchy for everybody. We've all had diarrhea at some point or another. We often look back on some of these stories and laugh. But if you have colon cancer, it may be a lot more frequent and much more frightening. This is due to all the complicated things happening with your colon. In some cases, a small clump of cells might develop in your colon's lining. This is known as a colon polyp. Over time, the polyp will become cancerous. As a result, your bowel habits will change. These bowel movements become more frequent, often appearing much looser. If you're having more than three liquid bowel movements a day, it's time to talk to a doctor. While it may be a symptom of several conditions such as irritable bowel syndrome and Crohn's disease, it can also be a sign of colon cancer. Number six, bloody stool. Yes, I'm afraid it only gets scarier. Finding blood in your stool is perhaps the sign most commonly associated with colon cancer. What makes this situation even worse is that sometimes the blood isn't always visible. That is, if you're checking your stool on a regular basis, something most people aren't doing. If your stool appears black, this may be due to dried blood. Another thing you should be mindful of is rectal bleeding, which often reveals itself in the form of blood on your toilet paper. If you notice this, get to your doctor ASAP, especially if you're over the age of 40. Number seven, abdominal pain. Colon cancer can cause your ab area to hurt. This symptom might be the most confusing as ab pains are associated with tons of other illnesses and conditions. While simply eating too much food can cause pain in your midsection, this discomfort might also be a sign of cancer. If the pain doesn't seem to die down and only gets worse as time goes on, troubles may be brewing in the colon. Since cancer is developing in your large intestine, your bowels are going through many serious changes. Naturally, your abdominals will hurt. This is normally accompanied by cramps and, well, this leads us to our next point. 
But before we continue, are you concerned about the state of your overall health? Check out our recent video discussing five early signs of bladder cancer that are mostly ignored by people. Now back to our list of 11 signs of colon cancer you need to look out for. Number 8. Bloating Cancer in the colon will cause excessive bloating as well as gas. This will also confuse you, being as bloating is more commonly a symptom of more minor conditions. If your bloating does happen to be directly related to colon cancer, it will be one of the later signs you experience. Bloating from colon cancer is brought on by two separate factors. The first is the tumor that has developed in the large intestine, the second being the cancer spreading to your lymph nodes. Number 9. Vomiting Like with many forms of cancer, vomiting may occur, but this can happen without the help of treatments like radiation or chemotherapy. If your stomach gets sick during colon cancer, it's usually because of the tumor in your large intestine. The tumor is causing blockage, making your stomach upset. The tumor is normally located right at the very end before the small intestines. While the urge to throw up can occur at any stage of colon cancer, it is most common in later periods. This vomiting will also be accompanied by feelings of extreme nausea. Number 10. Constipation Oh, the pains of having to use the bathroom! While colon cancer can cause you to use the toilet frequently, it can also make it more difficult. It all depends on how your bowels are feeling at that moment. In fact, diarrhea and constipation are known to alternate in the case of colon cancer. Keep in mind, constipation is another symptom that could be brought on by something else entirely. Something as simple as poor nutrition, a change in your diet, dehydration, and stress. Number 11. Mouth Ulcers not all colon cancers deal with your bowel area. You can also find visible symptoms in your mouth. While people normally associate ulcers with sores that develop in the stomach or intestine, mouth ulcers come in the form of canker sores. They're tiny and can hurt a lot. These types of ulcers are found on the lip and gum areas. They are usually the result of inflammation in the colon. This might be triggered by other symptoms, including your lack of appetite and weight loss. Since you're going without proper nutrients, your body doesn't have the energy. This takes strength away from your immune system. As a result, your body will be less able to fight infection. Have you had colon trouble? Will you be looking out for these signs now that you've watched this video? Let us know in the comments below. We would love to hear from you. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait! What kind of Bestie are we if we don't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left or right video, and enjoy.